Hi there and welcome to the Dawn Show. Dawn Stensland Menti here. So 2014 is upon us. We've already had wild weather. Football folds, oh no, by the Eagles and Chiefs. And then those twins born in different years. So what else can possibly happen this year? It's going to be an awesome one, I hope. But to Ooh. check in, we want to uh, check in with our master psychic, Carol Tolan, who's in the house. It's so good to have you, Carol. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Oh, my happy pleasure. new year. Happy, happy new year, Miss Shiny. I love that. Yeah, no, we'll talk about caught jewelry. My eye. Yeah, <laughs> my, my husband, it's Swarovski crystal, which I love the crystal. And I thought, this is very Carol <laughs> with the jewelry. You like the big, <laughs> chunky stuff, right? Yep. I never look good and dainty. <laughs> <laughs> That's not my thing. So um, talk about the Eagles, because as a master psychic, how do you watch a game like that? And we're way ahead. And do you have a vibe as to whether we're going to win or lose? OK, the first game I knew. I didn't even have to wonder. I knew. And I was so excited. The second game, I had that feeling that I get in my uh -oh. in my solar plexus and it was mm, they're not going to make it and I try and con myself into believing oh Carol put, <laughs> put that away put that away and I'm clicking and clicking and watching and now I better not watch and I wasn't surprised I was disappointed but it's um it's one of the things that's not fun for me you know to to know things that you don't want to know. What else, what else would you say when you watch television? Are there movie stars um, that you see that you have a vibe about that you feel like good or bad? Yes, as everybody else does, but I am, I have a nervous feeling about Angelina Jolie. Uh-oh. Uh, nervous. I don't like to put out negative stuff, but I, I don't feel any kind of good health for her in 2014. And that's such a, I mean, we, and we heard, of course, that, I mean, we know that her mom died at a young age and battled cancer and that she had the, the mastectomy and hysterectomy because uh, she wanted to avoid those types of right. cancers because she tested for the gene and everything. I don't think it's cancer I'm, I'm feeling. Oh. It's, it's almost like a nervous breakdown. Aww. Eek! I hope she's not listening. <laughs> but you, uh, I know that you've, my one sister-in-law, you told me that she had an ailment. You've never met her. You said her name, you, the first time I met you, and I called her up after the show, and she said, how do you know? And it was, it gave me those, it gave right. me those chill bumps, as I say, but she, and you said, get it, your sister-in-law needs a different specialist, and she did, and she's fine now. Oh, thank goodness. But you do have thank that health goodness. vibe, which is so interesting. Yeah, uh, it's called medical intuitive. It's the same to me as the animal communicator that I do. Now, I'm gonna tell you something. I was in Florida for like two and a half weeks, and don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. No, I could hear one of my plants, and I'm a plant fanatic crying all right no I'm, I'm not nuts believe me but I could hear the plant crying sure enough my Ming Aurelia that I adore was dead when I came home wow. and I have never lost a plant in 40 years wild mm-hmm wild mm -hmm. to me everything that's alive sends off messages energy yeah sometimes I want to hear it and sometimes I don't but I can't just, you know, differentiate. It's like, if it's gonna come, it's gonna come. And I should say, we are live and we are local, so we keep flashing our number if you have a question for Carol, whether it's a health question, a personal question. You know, as we look toward the year ahead, 2014, yes. Carol, what do you see, um, and I wanna th just throw out some things, like health. Everybody's talking about getting back in shape. We all gained those five to seven pounds over the holiday season. 15. 15. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, y you know, the year ahead, as you think about it, what are, what are your thoughts? I'm not l looking so much at health with people. What I see, there's going to be a lot of 
continuation of what everybody was doing. It's like pushing it further, pushing it uh, harder. They can't stop and say, oh, it's a new year and it's going to be okay. I don't see thing, people reaping the benefits of their work until eh, maybe the summer. The summer? Yeah, the summer. It's going to be a long, hard winter. Yes, I, I see that. You know, there'll be some good stuff here, good stuff there, but bottom line. Okay. That's what I'm seeing. When we come right back, Carol, I'm going to ask uh, Carol um, about her perceptions of the Pope and about uh, Chip Kelly, our Eagles coach, and much more, and take some of your phone calls when we come right back. <laughs> 